So after that last piece of crap, disgusting sack of bleep 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 mini art, I thought I'd build something that I'm going to enjoy. The French medium tank Samu S35 by my favorite model company, Tamiya. Let's get at her. All right, we've got the first two um, steps done. That's to me the usual, to me a goodness, perfect fit, it's just lovely. In about 40 minutes, we've got the running gear completely put together. Zero issues, everything fits like a dream. And it's super detailed, nicely engineered. Mm -hmm. To me, goodness. Okay, these have got to be the nicest link to link tracks I think I've put together in ages and ages. They click together, no glue necessary. Just follow the directions, line them up, put them down on top, and click them in. Wonderful tracks. Lower hall is complete. You'll have to excuse the funky lighting. I've got my blind down and it's light, uh, it's uh, a little windy out there. But the uh, lower hall is completely done. Absolutely zero problems, uh, no issues whatsoever. Perfect fit, perfect engineering, no putty anywhere. What an awesome, great kit. The turret pretty much drops together, but a couple things. Sorry, I should have showed you this before I put the, uh, the primer on it. Uh, I mean, see just a little bit of red along the back. Uh, the bottom of the turret will require some putty up along the edge there and around the side and around the bottom. Now this piece comes really weird. For some reason, instead of having the seam down at the bottom around, me and decided to put the seam right dead center, right through the middle, but it didn't need any putty. It just uh, it glued right up. It used quite a bit of hot glue, or not hot glue, but a, a really fast, aggressive glue. I think formed a nice little uh, seam and let her cure and it buffed right out no fail required there so all in all highly recommend it so far okay we've got this uh, Samu S35 all primed up what a lovely little kit I'm just got to put a of course got to put a antenna back there but it's been primed black in um, you know, that new Badger stylings uh, it's this has been setting for a couple of weeks now and it will, it will scratch off, but boy, you really got to put it to it. Not like the old uh, Vallejo. I highly recommend this, guys. Amazon. Uh, even for us in Canada, Amazon.com, it still comes in to be much cheaper with, if you can imagine, cheaper with shipping and dollar exchange. Get it from Amazon. I think Cohen had a bit about the same thing. That's where I got keyed into it. Good stuff. But back to this little kit. What a lovely, lovely, lovely little kit like all to me is it's nicely detailed it basically falls together there's no pitfalls highly recommended so i'm going to put this video together just basically of the build and everything else and i'll break painting out into a something separate all right later guys thanks for watching appreciate it